But the Republicans were able to cut back on the fact that only they only were not able. The only thing they couldn't defeat was the seniors. It cuts the deficit by one hundred and sixty billion dollars. One hundred sixty billion dollars. I'm serious. Think about it. Please welcome back to stage Senator Bernie Sanders. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. for the world's central kitchen strike, Mr. President. Would you consider conditioning military aid? Now, this spring is here. The seasons and allergies are on upon us. We're on the rise even more. I'm proud. <laughs> I'm proud of my administration has taken on Big Pharma in the most significant ways ever. And I wouldn't have done without Bernie. And Bernie got it. You know, look, no one in America will pay a single penny more in federal taxes if they make under less than they make less than four hundred thousand dollars a year. I wish I was able to do that. I was listed and Bernie will used to kid me about it. I was listed as the poorest man in Congress for 36 years. I didn't think I was poor. I got a good salary, but it was the poorest man in Congress. How did the White House decide who would attend the Iftar dinner? So uh, what I will say is um, I want to be careful here. Uh, you know, this meeting again was decided after we've done outreach for some time now. Uh, we wanted to make sure that this was a private meeting and that uh, participants had an opportunity to be, um, you know, to be to be honest and to be able to share their thoughts and feelings uh, about how, um, you know, how where they are, how they feel about the situation happening, obviously in the Middle East. Uh, I don't have a, a process uh, to lay out how uh, the list came about, uh, and so I'm, you know, don't have anything to, to lay out in that realm. But as you know, and as I have I stated a couple of times, we've done outreach. Uh, for this past several weeks, several months, uh, to the Muslim, to the Arab community, Palestinian community, and um, and heard from them directly. And they spoke, we listened, and uh, we hope that they feel like they had an opportunity to express themselves and had an opportunity uh, in front of the president and the vice president uh, to talk about an incredibly painful time. Was 